the brain can look ahead. You have eyes, you have ears, you can smell, you can plan, you can reason, you can integrate what's happening around you and, for example, avoid, say, hugging someone who has an infection. But the brain is limited to, it can control the nervous system and it can control behavior and actions, but it can't get down into really the trenches. The immune system cannot look ahead. It can only respond. So if you have an infection or if you have a cancer or looking at your social media too much, it can respond to that, but it can't plan. But in return for its inability to plan, it has extraordinary superpowers, but sort of blind. So we need both for this reason, because you need to be able to respond at the really local tissue level, like get down to like the smallest cell and at the same time plan so you don't put yourself in situations in which you need to mount a really serious immune response. To me, that's why it's important to understand this connection, because you need both. They need to work together. If you didn't need both, we wouldn't have both. Evolution would have done away with one or both of them a long time ago. That's why it's important to understand that they need to work together. It's indispensable to health and life for them to work together.